This is Certified Nerd and today I'm going to show you how to assemble the simple mount for the M1013 camera. For this build you're going to need a needle nose pliers and a Phillips screwdriver. The first thing you're going to want to do is to empty the contents of both bags onto the table. For step one, connect the middle piece to the top piece using the longest screw and one lock nut. Screwdriver may be required to push this screw all the way through. Now put a number 6 lock nut on the end of this screw. Use the needle nose pliers on the lock nut and the screwdriver to tighten this screw. Do not make this screw tight, the lock nut will hold it in place with it loose. This joint may be stiff at first. Moving it around a bit should loosen it up. Now use the two flathead number 6 machine screws to attach the slotted piece to the main assembly. Be sure to use the longer screw towards the front and the shorter screw towards the back. These screws should be fairly tight, but be careful of stripping the holes, as it is plastic. One of these screws is shorter. The shorter one is 5 eighths. Use it in this step. This screw does not need to be tight until the proper camera angle is achieved. Next, this base must be mounted to a surface on your robot. The holes are designed for number 6 flathead machine screws or small wood screws. A hole drill template is included in the bag. Once the base plate is mounted, connect the main assembly to it using the number 10 flathead machine screw. This should be just tight enough so that the mount doesn't wobble and loose enough so that it turns freely.
use the last number six machine screw and washer in this step. Now slide the camera in the top and use the number 8 lock nut and number 8 washer to secure it. Good luck with your robot and I hope you do well at competition.